OMG WTF, I just got on, said Sophia. Oh, Jesus, bloody, that was, you literally have two outfits. <laughs> Do I literally have two outfits? Oh no. I literally only own two items of clothing. My tragic life. I bet I should buy some more. Um, will you be my finger buddy? Now that's just a bit creepy. But it is related to the, to the thing that happened. Banana is the safe word. Daniel Piano, no. Daniel Piano, no. <laughs> What's it like voicing cheese? Yes. Oscar's Hotel. That's a cool thing. Obama. Yep. Saw that. Thoughts on High by the Beach? I know you guys said this. Um, High by the Beach. It's not as good as Honeymoon. It's like, because Honeymoon, it went like, because you know how Lana Del Rey is like half retro pastiche? High by the Beach was a lot more modern, and I felt like, I don't know, like, just like, yeah, I by the beach, yeah, I by the beach, yeah. Uh, but it was enjoyable. Please tell us two casual Dan facts. I am not wearing socks right now. I'm not wearing a t-shirt under this jumper. There we go. It looks like I am. It just has layers. There we go. Pow, pow, pow. Nice gif with the meme glasses, said Tommy. And the, the meme, the meme glasses, did you, do you mean the, the deal with it glasses? Yeah, the, uh, the, um, the book promo gifts. Jesus Christ, just get a dog. One day, Rebecca. One day. And just for my own mental health, I don't, cheeky me. Did you see that there? Um, how are you today, Dan? I'm not. Someone in the vicinity of this apartment is frying onions with spices in a pan. That's a very specific smell, like the slight smell of, but it's masala. And now, I feel like I smell a bit of cheese in the pan or some, I smell cheese, wow. I need to close that window, I'm getting hungry. I can't have cheese. Are you a feminist, said Sophia. Absolutely. If, you know, to <laughs> depending on whether you're going by the, the stupid definition of people that don't understand it, or the actual one. Do you have big hands? Yeah, disgusting hands. I don't understand, like, are you a feminist? No? What the f- what does that mean? Feminists suck. It's happening right now. In the last two years, feminism has gone from being a perfectly understood concept to almost being this joke that people circle jerk against out of a place of complete misunderstanding and ignorance about what it is and why it's important. Just like when when jokes about things that are funny and go too far end up, you know, going into, you know, what, take an ignorant person and take an important issue, then take jokes about the important issue and then put, you know, you have someone who has the knowledge about the important issue and the jokes and gets them both and then you have someone that doesn't understand the important issue and then just hear the jokes and then it's kind of like their entire perception of it is just the jokes and how honestly like terrifying and dangerous that is and it just makes me panic about the future of humanity. Um, so I'm gonna go. I'm making, I made a seven second challenge app. We worked so hard on it. We made a book, which is the thing that Phil and I, we've worked the most incredibly hard on anything in our entire lives. We've finished the book, it's being printed, we're gonna start promoting it soon. The book is everything I ever dreamed it would be. The tour is gonna be soon. My God, the Dan and you aren't ready. You know, trying to make Dan and Phil video, trying to make videos on Dan is not on fire that despite, you know, whether or not they are good, I worry about if they are. And then, you know, there's so many things, so little time. Ciao dudes, thank you for joining me. Uh -huh.